Woods with his second road start is in South Bend in prime time. Quickly they get it in the hands of R.J. Shelton. They run him a lot. Go to get center. Brian Allen up front is one of their best offensive linemen and has a ton of experience. Scott with that carry and L.J. Shy of the 35. Once again, it is Scott. And he'll get just a little more than three yards to Nevada. You know the Spartans will be testing him at some point tonight. Option look. O'Connor keeps and gains a couple of yards. Doug Tum Spartans go five wide, third and four. Notre Dame brings Morgan with pressure. The pass is caught by the fullback Prescott line. Did he get to the line? It's a keeper. And spinning and turning his back is the six foot three Tyler O'Connor. And the motion it's RJ Shelton. He's just a ghost to kind of go chase as they hand it off to LJ Scott. They'll only gain a yard to the left side here. These are all offensive linemen. Run the ball behind that on the fourth down play. There were two tight ends plus a big fullback in there. They're going to have some power formations where there's a lot of beef. So Second and eight. Couple of fakes. O'Connor looked deep. It was deep. It was covered. But comes back to Shelton. It's a nice for the screen. So both quarterbacks in right now for the Spartans. Just deception as they hand inside to Scott. And he'll gain a yard. You know, Doug, we don't know what Michigan State's doing. This is second and nine. O'Connor over the middle, incomplete. There's no situation too big for him. We'll start from the 25 and give it to L.J. Scott. Four-yard run to the 29. LJ. Second and six run up the middle. Scott is stopped. Loss of two yards on that one, Jay Hay and Terry. The other quarterback comes in to take the snap as O'Connor comes out as a receiver. And Terry is hit by Niles Morgan and hit hard. Quarter. Deshaun Passer touchdown run the difference. Pressure off the corner from Notre Dame. O'Connor fires complete to Mikey Medeiros who made a man miss. And Medeiros in open space to the 23-yard line. Time player. He doesn't have blazing speed, but he's going to be big time. O.J. Scott with the run to the left and buzzing up from the cold. corner spot. Michigan State, another good one. Quarter starts with second and 11 and a shovel pass in tight quarters to Josiah Price, who's a captain for this game. And the Indiana native who gets a baron on the run here. Very talented players. The future bright, but the bright lights are on right now. Gerald Holmes is the running back for Michigan State. He starts this drive against Notre Dame on the great play by Corley, the two-point conversion, and then add that. Spartans gain momentum. O'Connor, nobody open, takes off, takes a hit. Gains five yards. Niles Morgan, the last game against Furman. Rotating centers. This guy up front. Allen's in the middle now as O'Connor eludes the sack. He unloads. He's going to take that shot downfield. He couldn't get it to Felton Davis. The third. end of the season have become expected. And he has talked about that and handled it so far. L.J. Scott with the game for four. And Caffrey. He made Connor Cook as a starter, guys. I like Mom's motivation there. That's, that's a good line from Mom. Prescott line with the carry for a couple of yards. But, but, but to amplify Caffrey. He's been in this offense for five years. He knows it inside and out. He's not an inexperienced. Okay. There's Corley on the edge, and he'll get the first down. Two and a half left until halftime. O'Connor keeping, was patient, waiting for the block, and takes it into Irish territory at the 40. He goes zone read, and 75, McGowan seals the corner. Allen outside with a push. Just a great, gets an effective run. Second and four, here is Scott, and a good push now from this Spartan offensive line. Jerry Tillery chasing it down from behind as he gets the line. And jump cut here by Scott. They want to watch the clock with a minute 35 to go. One point lead for today against Florida State. The guys are going to have all those highlights at halftime. Here comes RJ Shelton as he comes around. Drew Tranquil is waiting. Field goal range here as Michigan State slow plays it with 40 seconds left. And O'Connor out of the pocket on the run trying to get the first down. Now the ball is in his left hand as he goes on going forward. 34 seconds, two timeouts. O'Connor trying to wheel it out there. It's Corley. He's thrown back into the band, but that's if they have a lot of options here with 28 seconds left. Pitch it to Shelton. R.J. Shelton on the edge. Got a block. Got a Spartan touchdown. But you know when the window is short, then you have to get him. So that's what Kelly's thinking. 
Got to keep Michigan State off the board as well. Tyler O'Connor passed it in traffic and on the deflection. It was all stands for what he delivers. He's put Michigan State back on the map in college football. Here's R.J. Shelton with that quick hit. Not going anywhere. The Irish defense. Within your program. This is third down and 10 for O'Connor. Hit by Rochelle as he throws. And it's incomplete programs here around the Great Lakes. Been able to build something special in East Lansing. R.J. Scott with the carry and the spin. Good gain of seven for Scott. Offense, and those are the type of kids he can recruit. Second down. Scott will get the first down. Across the 40. And to the 43-yard line. He'll fix that to a T. He's a defensive coach. This is the kind of offense he'd like. A little trouble on the handoff with O'Connor and Scott. And Niles Morgan tackles him after a gain of a snaps in the opener as the backup running back. Second and nine option. And it's two homes. Initial contact to not loud enough to communicate here in the noise. Holmes gets to the edge. He's pulled down as in there well coached unit showing up big here first and ten Holmes ducks left but he's not gonna get past Tavon Coney on your TV on Golf Channel and NBC in a couple of weeks and the Spartan timeout second and ten pass complete RJ Shelton makes a man miss and Shelton's inside the five he knows down and distance wise I'll give him a little cushion and break up on it Shelton steps out of the tackle with Cole Luke you want to miss outside and make him cut back to the inside Seen on the game, Gerald Holmes following his blocks to the end zone. Touchdown, MSU. To deliver another blow here. LJ Scott is the back. Pushing the pile. And Spartan football game is six. On that first down, the ropes a bit. With 6.50 remaining. Here in the third, Scott. Brian Allen paving the way. Great block by Allen. Takes Scott down to the... The guy's pulling didn't meet any resistance until downfield. Right back to Scott. Right up the middle into the end zone. I mean, this is just... He's taking his time with the run because the offensive line is body on body and throwing people around. And Price got upfield to the linebacker level and closed... After a bye week. He was not thrilled to have a bye week. This early in the season, this is R.J. Shelton, who scored earlier on a little push between some tough love, which he got used to from his dad when he was coaching him back in his high school days. Up the middle, it is Gerald Holmes, past midfield, in a foot race with Luke. Not going to get him. Holmes is all